I wish you could hear what I'm hearing right now, um, which is pretty much nothing. <laughs> All I can hear is the silence of the countryside and, uh, and some birds singing their little hearts out. So today I'm in a friend of mine's little cottage. Um, I just needed to get out of my home space and home environment and into a different space, um, away from any distractions you know, kids, housework, husband, dog, whatever, away from all of that, and just have a day to myself, nearly a day to myself, to do what I wanted to do. And I've been putting this off and putting this off and putting this off, and um, I finally did it. So I'm sat here today and it's, oh, it just feels great. And I've got no expectations of what I'm gonna do today. Um, you know, I'm gonna go with the flow for a little bit. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do some like, kind of work on myself, some goal setting intentions, just kind of get my head a little bit clear. I feel like I've stumbled into 2018, not kind of knowing what's going on and that's okay. It takes a little bit of time, I think, to get over the whole Christmas weirdness. Um, and also what I'm doing is um, going into creativity mode. And I find I have to be in the right environment and the right get to help get myself in the right headspace to to create. And that's what I want to do today is um, is kind of get my creative juices flowing. And something I'm really passionate about is, as many of you will know, is the menopause and how it affects women and what we can do to our, help ourselves. And one of the things I did last year was I had this idea that I wanted to help women help themselves. So kind of tapping into, I called it your wisdom, and it's a way of work for women to create their own unique menopause manifesto, their own kind of blueprint, if you like. And I kind of, I did a, uh, I, I did a little bit of, of a taster session last year, and I, and I got some great feedback, and I've got, you know, I'm going to put some um, different ideas into action, and this is the thing I'm going to be working on mainly this year, is um, helping women help themselves. So rather than just giving everyone just a blanket kind of um, checklist or, or to-do list or plan or whatever. I want to encourage women really to kind of get into themselves a little bit more and understand what they need because we're all different. Uh, it's different on the outside as the insides and we have different needs. So I, and I think if we create something ourselves, we've got much more of a chance of following a plan or whatever it is we think we need to get to the outcome we want. So if it's symptoms, if it's big life changes, whatever it is, I think we need to be creating this ourselves. And that's what I want to help women do, help them create it and give them some kind of like signposts and goals and, and a little bit of help along the way. So this is where you guys come in and I need your help. Uh, I've got an idea what I want to put into my the Menopause Manifesto. I'm going to write a workbook. I'm going to be presenting courses and talks and workshops this year all around it. But I'd want your input. What is it you would like to see in like a workbook? This is creating your own menopause midlife blueprint. What kind of things would help you move through this transition and it can be to do with anything whether it's you know nutrition and lifestyle or exercise or relationships anything like that just you know a bit of, i'm wanting you really to have a bit of a brainstorm if you like just to give me some ideas what you need so i can put that in this manifesto and then you you know we all win don't we you get what you want and i get to provide you guys what you actually need so if you could help me, that'd be great. You could put it in the comments below this video or you could send me a, a, a PM, that's fine. But you know, I would really, really, really value your input because it's gonna help me create something perfect for you guys. Yeah, exciting time. So I'm gonna go off and I don't know if you can see in the background, there's my little bit of um, all my creative stuff. I've got coloring pens and post-it notes and paper and I'm just gonna kind of go a little bit crazy and get all these ideas coming together. So menopause manifesto, your wisdom, what would you like to see? Thanks guys.